and I saw different brands, uh, some that were like kind of within the budget that I wanted to spend, like not more than $300. Um, I, I, I didn't feel confident that they would overperform what I already had. Um, you know, and being an engineer and the pod mobile being kind of a small device, I'm like, I'll just build it. I'll just design and build one for me. Um, so I the, love that. <laughs> so the, <laughs> okay, I'll make one. <laughs> I'll make one. I actually, I, let me show you the, the first one because it's painfully <laughs> ugly. This is the first oh. pod mobile, okay? Oh my goodness. How do you, yeah. yeah, it's it's so yeah, so it's just for people listening, this baby. is very different from what I received and from yeah. what others have have seen, and and Imagine from that, that lovely shiny unit that you just showed me before uh -huh. we started. Uh -huh. So yes. yeah, oh my goodness, sounds great though. This works yeah. great. Sounds great. Just just you should just should not look at it very much because you know <laughs> it might give you stomach ache or something. Oh no. <laughs> um, oh well, you know you got to start somewhere, right? Absolutely. And that's the thing, you know, you got to start, you know, if you if you're just thinking, oh, I need to design it to be pretty or whatever. And that was like bare bones functional. I just needed to be functional. And the initial idea is that it would be only one channel, one headphone out, one microphone in USB done. Um, but then I figured, what if what if I have an interview with somebody, right? Uh, being interviewed or interviewing somebody. Why not just, you know, sort of copy and paste and put another channel there? So I did that. So this one has two channels. And and then this this great friend I have, Jeff, which, by the way, I met him playing the guitar. It was spring and I was playing the guitar at home. I'm going to go back to it. I'm going to branch out just real quick. I was playing the guitar totally, at home. Go ahead. Uh, and then I'm like, why am I doing this? I should, you know, at least be out there, you know, like, and, and then I just took my gear and start playing music at this gazebo near a sushi place. And this guy comes out and he says, Hey, I'll give you 50 bucks to play for my friends at the restaurant. I'm like, fine. Great. And then that's how we met and we became great friends. And now he's actually my, um, equity partner in this. How things Wonderful. happen, right? right? So he saw yeah. this first thing here. He was really impressed with the sound, of course. It's amazing that he got over the looks of it. Um, <laughs> it was actually Jeff and his wife saw this and they were like, wow, this sounds so great. And, you know, and they, they really liked it. And they have a friend who uh, started a podcast. Sounds terrible, but the content is absolutely great. And uh, actually, I really liked their content. And Jeff came up to him and said, hey, I have the right thing for you. You know, because Jeff is like, he can sell ice in Alaska, right? <laughs> Good for him. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. It's a, it's a great, it's the best skill to have. Honestly, if you, if you could have one skill in life, I think that's it. Communication, well, sales. Well, good to have that as a partner. Oh, absolutely, Right. Because I'm a terrible yeah. salesperson. I'm afraid. I'm shy. I don't want to be like, you know, uh, I, I don't know. I just feel such an internal resistance to say, hey, look at my stuff. And it costs this much. And you should have one because this, this, and that, you know. But it has no problem whatsoever with that. So, <laughs> uh, so he sold that in terms of an idea to this uh, podcast. Um, and, and then... I'm like, okay, I, I can't deliver that ugly thing. It's just, I can't do this. You know, like personally, I, be feel, I feel embarrassed. So then, then I shaped it differently. Then I made the second one that looks much like this one that you have. Minus a few things. It's not as pretty, but it's, it's, it's 80% there. And that was the pod mobile. And then his friend, he, he sent it to a friend and he said, well, but what if you want to have more than two people? I'm like, Good okay, question. Re great. And I'm like, you know, the audience that I'm targeting is people that are doing the, the audiobook recordings and, you know, solo podcasts. Maybe it's not necessary, but what if I throw an expansion port in it and I can daisy chain it? So it just came to be that way. And there's so much, uh, there, there are a lot of markets that this fits. You know, there's this, it's a product that, Works for voiceover, podcasts, uh, audiobook recordings, interviews. It will scale. You can buy one, so two people, and then later you can get another one. 
or your friend has one so you don't have to buy one. Um, and people seem to love it.